This sound signifies the end of Lieutenant General Oloide's tenure as the commander of the Infantry Corps and the beginning of a new era under the leadership of Major General Abdul Khalid Ibrahim. Addressing journalists after the ceremony, General Oluyede, who is also the acting chief of army staff, urged the new commander to uphold the high standards of the infantry corps. He emphasized the importance of extensive training to prepare soldiers for field operations and enhance their effectiveness in tackling security challenges. For the army to succeed, we need the infantry. So you need to move the infantry forward embark on massive training. So for the criminals out there, they should be ready for a good run from us because we're going to go out all, all out for them. And for Nigerians, we'll try as much as possible to make Nigeria more secure. Speaking further to officers and soldiers, Oloyede highlighted the need for bravery and discipline within the ranks while assuring all personnel of the army's commitment to their welfare and that of their families. The fact is that these people are coming, they are cowards. So you don't need to run from them. You have been trained to face these kind of challenges. So this morning, I've come to promise you that everything that has to do with the welfare, I'm going to confront it headlong. But on your part, you must do your work. Is that clear? Yes, sir. You must do your work, and you must do your work well. The leadership transition marks a renewed drive for operational excellence and national security under the Nigerian army. Abimaja Moses, AIT News, Kaduna.